My name's uh, Dick Sirota. I'm the owner of the uh, House of Guitar right here in Priestville. Uh, it's a pleasure to be with everybody out there right now. Uh, I'm going to go through a fast career of mine. Uh, I was brought up in a, a musical family. Uh, my uncles were professional musicians. Uh, very good, by the way. My uncle, uh, at 18, uh, asked the audition for the Philadelphia Orchestra. And as a little kid, about five, six years old, my father uh, bought me a little ukulele. And uh, they used to, my uncles used to take me to rehearsals with, with the band. And uh, I'd be in a corner, and I'd be uh, picking out little melodies with my little ukulele, you know, as, uh, trying to pick things up by ear. And uh, I was brought up around music, uh, I guess, uh, as you know by now. And uh, our uh, decor in the home was a bass fill in the corner. It was a guitar, a piano in the other corner, and a mandolin, a violin. So uh, our decor was a house full of uh, instruments. Uh, I had an offer to uh, go uh, take a tour of playing music uh, in Europe, which involved uh, being in Italy, France, and Yugoslavia at that time. So I went, went to Wildwood. Uh, during the summer, then we were the house band. We we're, uh, were fortunate enough. We played. We backed up uh, so many. Uh, we backed up the Platters. Uh, they, they they were they were fabulous. Uh, we were going to go to the South Sea Islands uh, with the uh, with the Platters, and uh, that's uh, when the Vietnam War was going on at the time, and uh, that was didn't uh, materialize. But uh, so time it went on, and and from there there was a lot of different acts came in. We backed up uh, Benny King. Uh, who left the Drifters, and he went and went out as a solo. We backed him up, and then right after that, uh, we had uh, the Drifters, and he he was with the Drifters. And Donna Washington came in, the Isley Brothers, so so many uh, uh, groups uh, came in. Brooke Benton, I don't know if you remember a name like that, but uh, we we backed them all up. Uh, the band broke up, and then I had an offer uh, from uh, from our uh, uh, from the musicians union. Uh, had a, at that time, oh, fairly decent res reputation, and they recommended me. Uh, uh, they, they were there, so I was looking for a, a, a guitar player, you know, and uh, go on this little tour with the, the Everly Brothers. And uh, prior to that, I had a call to go with uh, Tony Orlando and and Dorn out, out in Vegas. But yeah, at that time, I had too many commitments. I couldn't. I had contracts, and I couldn't get out of the. Uh, the obligation, so I had to turn it down. But with the Everly Brothers, it was a short stint uh, out the Midwest. <laughs> I just made that up. So. 